All right, we're going to go to a book that we don't go too often. Go with me to Lamentations chapter 3, verse 22 and 23 for our prayer scripture of the week. I enjoy being around little toddlers. There's something about their energy. The, the second that they walk into the room, this new energy is just kind of introduced, this happiness and this like never ending flow of go, 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 go. Cause that's what toddlers do. They want to see, they want to experience. They're looking, they're asking questions. They're touching on things. They're playing with things. They'll have a complete breakdown and then they'll bounce right back up. Toddlers are amazing when it comes to their energy and they just go until they can't go no more. And then they completely crash. When my oldest son, Justin was a toddler, We'd taken him to a complete trip right here to New Orleans before we lived here. We took him to the zoo. He had an amazing day. And that night we were at home feeding him spaghetti. And I remember still to this day, he was slumped over in his chair, spaghetti hanging from his face. He was completely done for. That's what toddlers do. They go until they can't go no more. They rest, they take a nap, and then they're right back up at it, going right through it again endless energy that just never stops and we're jealous we want that energy we want that energy so we can accomplish all the things that we have to accomplish in our day let me read lamentations to you it says the steadfast love of the lord never ceases his mercies never come to an end they are new every morning great is your faithfulness his love is never ending. It never ceases. It never stops pursuing after you. You can never get to the end. His mercies, they're brand new every single day, even when you think you have reached the very end of them, that there can be no more mercy for your life. When you wake up, they're brand new and they're fresh every single day. His love endures. He is constantly pursuing you. He is a faithful father and he is pursuing after you with endless mercies and endless love. And when all of your circumstances, when all of your situations try to tell you that he has forgotten, that you've reached the end, that you've made too many wrong turns, this is a promise that you can pull out, a promise that you can refresh your heart with, you can remind your mind, that you can make sure are coming through the words that his faithfulness endures. He is great in his faithfulness. His mercies are never ending. They're fresh every single morning. His love is enduring and pursuing after me every single day of my life. You cannot reach the end. And this is our prayer scripture of the week. Write it down, pray it, worship it, whatever it takes. This belongs to you and me. This is a promise for us that he is going to endure. His love is going to pursue. His mercies are never ending. He's great in faithfulness. Pray it. Write it down, remind yourself, when life tries to tell you otherwise, this is a promise that you can lean on. I pray that this encourages you this week. If so, do me a favor, hit the like button. Leave us a comment. What are you praying for? What are you pursuing after? How do you remind yourself that his love is enduring and that he is great in faithfulness? Hit that subscribe button. Come back as we look at the simple principles of God to experience the best relationships possible, the ultimate relationship being with Jesus Christ. As always, until next time, God bless. Yeah. Smash that like and subscribe. subscribe.